what is up guys my name is warren so welcome to my another react tutorial last week i reached 500 subscribers it's a great start thank you for your support so far uh, if you haven't subscribed my channel please subscribe like my videos it really means a lot to me if you want to buy me a coffee you can find the link in the description okay today's tutorial i'm gonna build simple react counter wrap okay let's get into the video this is very simple tutorial uh, first of all uh, open the source folder and create the new component so create a file i'm going to call it counter.js now i'm going to create a functional component so i'm using a snippet called the es7 uh, react redux uh, graphql react native snippet and you can install it so go to extension and search uh, react here the second one just uh, install this snippet uh, it will be extremely useful close that so type rfc uh, that means uh, react functional component so for the counter app first we need to import a juice state so it's from react so you state right now we are going to use the you state so const let's call it uh, count then a function for uh, set the count value so let's call it set count right it's equal to you state here we need to give the initial value for the count so let's say zero right now we have count uh, its value is zero so i'm going to display that value here here we say uh, the count is um, and let's uh, show the uh, count value here so count right so save it uh, now go to app.js so clean up this code and let's uh, import the uh, counter component so counter as you can see counter component is uh, imported automatically let's start our app so go to terminal npm start Yes, you can see the initial value here, it's zero. So now we are going to create two buttons, one for increment and another one for decrement. Okay, go back to VS Code and go to counter.js. So now I'm going to create two buttons. Button on click, then we are going to set the value. So an arrow function, then we need to call the set count so here set count then we are going to add one with the count so now the count is zero so count plus one so let's call it increment and close the button and copy this for the decrement This should be other way this should be minus okay now let's check it increment decrement it's a very very simple tutorial uh, that's it guys thank you for watching if you have any doubts please comment below if you want more tutorials please comment in the comment section so i will make a video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you guys see you in the next tutorial